In the first error handling activity, we're going to look at some common error handling situations. This is on pages 33 to 37 of the activity guide. In the training account, I'm going to add a folder under developer 2 to house the error handling activities. Browse the process library, and I'm going to bring in error handling activity 1. We're looking here for dev error handling activity one. So we'll install that in that folder. In this process, the start shape reads a database table and then returns four documents. They are mapped from database profile to XML profile, and then the root shape is going to send the documents by category with each document flowing down a different path. So we have the exception shape, a map, Salesforce, which is a bad connection, and then uh, the default path. What I'm going to do first is to load here in the start shape our Boomi Training MySQL connection click Save, and then we'll run a test and look at the errors that are generated. All right, so here is our first error message. This is from the first document. So there's an error message received from the web service, an invalid login, could be a username, password, security token, or the user is locked out. We'll close that, and then we'll look at each of the errors. So starting here with the first document, this is failing here at the exception shape. And we see that exception shape has logged this error, that the contact has a bad category. Now the second document, you'll see is actually stopping execution here at the root shape. And we'll come back and talk about that in just a moment. The third document is failing here at the map shape. If we look at the log, there's an error formatting number error. And then the fourth document So the login error was a process error, and this was the subject of our initial pop-up error message. The others are coming from the exception shape, the map, and then the bad connector login. And it's the document errors that stop processing the do a specific document, but the process error here stopped processing all of the documents. And if we go back to our second document, which stopped at the root shape, document two executed last. This is due to the category values in the data. So it had not yet progressed when document three encountered a processing error, which stopped all documents from processing. 